Welcome to Agriculture Miami's discussions on some of my projects. I am here at my project in next to the shores in Biscayne Park, and there's been some dramatic, dramatic changes to the location. I'm noticing this tree behind us here has really, really grown in amazing. Just over the, the amount of rains that we've had torrentially, it's really taken up shape. But these are not trees that we've planted, but they're definitely covering in and growing in pretty fast. It's really awesome how things grow. <laughs> Amazing how they grow. But the changes that I'm talking about are these changes here. As you can see, the owner had decided to make some drastic changes to the front, which I think looks very nice. As a matter of fact, a little more modern cliche, which is great, but he still has left some of the plant life that we had produced and put down. And they're still growing quite well, as a matter of fact and um, taking shape over time. I see some papayas that are taking place here. Still got some basil that has made it through the rains and the, the heat. And the citrus in the back is still growing. But I noticed a lot of things have been taken out, like of course in the front here. And um, the beds that were here once, some are no longer here. Looks like he's putting in something else. Not sure what exactly that would be. But yeah, he's got the front all squared off and lined up, and he's got some agave in the front here, and two more mounds in the front. So it matches the house, and we're now witnessing a very stark contrast to the land. It looks like he's putting in some piping, but the place, he's got some new flowers here that look very pretty. And I see the yucca root is gone, so he's probably harvested that. All of the um, the plants that are in front are gone. There was a very large, large um, moringa that was here. But that's gone, and the moringa in the back is gone. So I get, hopefully he used that by bringing it back into the soil. I see he planted some eggplants here, which is nice. And this citrus, this lime is growing very well, very bushy. Um, I see the bananas are amazingly, amazingly growing very, very well and very, very big. And actually one of the bananas has a flower on it, if you can see it there. And it's already pushing out some fruit. So it's now September, what is it, September 13th. And we planted those bananas in March. So I'm very impressed with the speed in which things are growing. He's took out, he's taken out most of the sugar cane, or harvested most of the sugar cane. And I see a lot of little sprouts and new growth of sugar cane coming back into place. And he's taken out most of the um, nitrogen fixing plants. There are a few left, some sun hemp left, and I see a pigeon pea left. Um, but for the most part, yeah, things are still growing pretty well. So. Just wanted to give you an update. There you go. There you have it with the progress of the growth and production of food on one person's lot right in front of their home. And, you know, as time goes on, things will continually change and develop over time. It'd be nice to see what this looks like within the coming months. There's a lychee still growing in, pluming out, lots of leaves. I still see some, um, some pineapple growing very well and these are the guavas in the front here that are still taking shape taking its time but yeah let's see what happens peace